groups like this and the seafarers that work on board are often the unseen link in our consumer lives. Something like 90% of everything we see on our shelves arrives by sea. It can be tomatoes, cricket bats, yep, cricket bats, leather, willow, cotton, chemicals, yeah, it all comes in by sea. So these ships and their crews are a vital link in our world. Most seafarers come from countries and cultures from all over the world and they can be away at sea for up to nine months and that's away from home and family. Now nine months, that's 273 days broken only by port stops to unload and load cargo and during those stops they might not even get off the ship before they're on the way again. It can be a very, very lonely and isolated existence. Now let me read you what one of those seafarers has written. I send money home every month, he says, to pay for the mortgage for a house I don't live in, to buy food for my family, but I don't eat with them, to pay for my kids' education, but I can't walk them to school or get to their graduation. I pay for their health care, but when they're sick, I'm usually thousands of miles away. What other choice do I have to earn a living? The Sailor Society care for these seafarers and their families with a network of multi-denominational chaplains. Those chaplains visit the crews on board and are there for those seafarers when they need them most. They're also involved in educational and poverty relief programs which they operate in developing countries around the world in those seafaring communities. So, on behalf of seafarers and their families all around the world, I'd just like to say a huge thank you to you for your support. Thank you.